Hello guys, I'm Seraphim190, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you the most simplest, awesomest, less resources for us uh, on and off portal I've ever seen. I've, I came up with this all by myself. It's very easy to do guys, and if you don't like pressure plates, you can indeed use buttons. Okay, he's cute as a button. Look how perfect this is. It is completely seamless. No redstone, you can't see any problems, okay? So what you need is a boot, I would say about 10 obsidian pieces, it's 5 by 6 so work that out. Okay, we need about 4 repeaters, I would say 10 redstone pieces, redstone dust for sure. Um, about a stack of fire chargers, if you can get a stack of fire chargers. Um, and also, you might need a, about 2 dispensers, a painting, and a grass block. You can either use pressure plates or buttons with this. And as you can see, I'm simply making this shape here. It's 5 by... Yeah, about that shape so you can get that painting on there. So what you want to do is have one dispenser facing in, one up. The one up is facing straight into that piece of obsidian right on the left. So you can just fill that up now with fire charges and just fill that up with some dirt. Put a pressure plate in bow. Yeah, that's the first part done, that's very simple. So we'll come to the second part, you need another pressure plate. Now this is a little different, we just want to break underneath it like this with some redstone dust and connect it underneath. Come around the side and do the same. Bring it up a block and you might want to whack it into a repeater. So the trick here guys is we want it to tick twice. So bring a lead, it's straight directly into this uh, into that dispenser. So as soon as you press the button, that dispenser will shoot off. Then we want to compare it over here on four ticks facing into this one, into that block. And we want another repeater here on four ticks, and another repeater facing this way on four ticks. This way, um, the fire, the charge, <laughs> blah, the charge will come through a little slower, ticking it twice, turning the water on and off really quickly. And that way, you'll be able to turn the portal off and on, very easy. And obviously guys, um, if you don't want to use pressure plates, just swap them for buttons. And you're good as Ray. I'll show you how that's done at the end. So what we want to do is put a back on this. Let's test it out. First we want to put some water buckets in here actually. So let's grab some water out. And simply put that into the dispenser. There we're done guys. So let's test it out real quick. And it should turn back off. Perfect. Alright, that's perfect guys, that is so cool. On and off. Okay, so yeah, let's get the back on there. Uh, you guys can use glowstone so you can have a bright background. Or you can just simply cover it up, it doesn't really matter. So once that's done, all you need to do is get out your painting and get the right painting to cover that whole thing. So I'm trying to get this one here. There we go, we're done. Alright, let's test it out again, let's see if that works. As you can see, the water comes through the back of the painting, not breaking it at all. So it's completely hidden, you cannot see where it's coming from, which is cool. So if you want to put a button there instead, you might want one more repeater and some redstone dust. Just put two buttons on either side, break underneath where this pressure plate was, and you'll see where the dispenser is, so break. Hey, what is going on over here? Hey, did you step on that pressure plate? So yeah, pressure plates can be quite, get away. Get can be quite annoying, so yeah, let's change it for buttons. Okay, so at the side of this button, where at the back here you want to get out some redstone, so when you press it, uh, it will activate. Same here, so let's get this broken at the back here, where the button is coming out, and drag some redstone out the back, simply plug it in the back of that dispenser down one block. So when you press it, it'll work, fill that up with grass, uh, we're done. Oh wait, put a repeater at the back of the left one, guys. Very important, it has to come out from a repeater or it won't work. So as you can see here, I'm just connecting it up with some redstone dust and put that on four ticks as well. So what you want to do, if you've already got water coming out, you want to reset it, okay? Because it's So break that, press it again, and when it turns off, now you can put your repeater down. So if you've already pressed it, that's how you fix it. Okay, put that on four ticks, and we're done! FACTION! Okay, so that is very exciting. I'm excited, I'm amazing. This is amazing build. Perfect build, look at that, perfect. Perfect portal. Guys, if you've seen an easier, perfect, simpler portal, please let me know in the comments. 
and show me a picture or something so I can see. Uh, I'm Sarah from 190. Please share my videos uh, with all the world. Check out all my other tutorials. I have millions. And um, don't forget to like and subscribe.